Hey guys, welcome back to Critter Corner 1. I want to show you some more rescues of mine. These are rats. I have a hairless and then I have a gray one with fur. So these were an impulse buy a mother bought for her child and after the child showed no more interest in them, they decided they wanted to rehome them. They were actually going to let them go in the wild and um, I intervened and took them. They are very sweet. They're not from the same litter, but they are sisters. They love to be around each other. They're super friendly. Very friendly. Yes, Dior. Very friendly girls. Please research your pets before you buy them and do not buy on impulse because that ends up turning out into a disaster especially when your child no longer wants to have them as a pet. Then what do you do? You have to find somebody like me to take them in or you let them go. And that's the worst case scenario. You don't ever want to let your pets go. Say hi. My hairless is Hera and my gray girl right there, that's Cleo. Hi Cleo. Hi girls, I hear you. They love attention. They love running around in their rat ball. Right now they're too small for the big cage that I have for them. So they're in this one. Hold on, let me lock this. So they're in this one for right now. In about two months, they're gonna get moved into the bigger cage. With rats, if they can fit their head through the slots, then they can flatten their bodies out and actually escape. And so that's why they're in this because they are unable to stick their faces through the bars. If I were to put them in the big one, they can escape it and then I'd have rats running around my house. I have to give them more food and I have to give them more water, which I'll do as soon as I get out of this video. They also are due for their cage to get cleaned. I clean their cage every two days. Hey, Hera. Hey, Cleo. They love attention. They love to come out. They love to play. They love to run around. Please, guys, please research your pets and please do not buy things on impulse for children, especially young children, especially things like rats because they're fast. They do tend to nibble a little bit. They don't bite. They're actually really good pets, but they do nibble and on a young child and nibble could hurt. And then you're going to want to <clears throat> get rid of it or they're going to get ignored and that's not good for them either. We don't want any pet to be ignored. If you buy it for a pet, you're supposed to take care of it and love it and do the right thing by it for the rest of its life. Unfortunately, hey baby. Unfortunately, this parent was unable to do so. Bless you, bless you. All right, that's it for my girls. Miss Hera the hairless rat and Miss Cleo say goodbye. As always, feel free to comment, like, and subscribe. Have a great day and I'll see you guys later.